Well, hello everyone, it's me, Daniel with Website Candy, and today I just want to give you a quick tip here in reference to removing wrinkles here in Photoshop. And I have our Commander in Chief here, and I'm going to zoom in on him drastically there to kind of get into the forehead area and around the mouth area right there. One thing you want to do is you want to come over here and you want to select your spot healing brush right here, and you want to make sure that your content aware and sample all layers is selected there. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to come over here, create a new layer. And now what we're going to do is we're just going to kind of just mouse around and we're just going to just find the wrinkles that we want to remove. And we're just going to touch those wrinkles just really quickly. Uh, you don't necessarily have to have uh, precision here. You can kind of just select as you will. And what we can do is we can with our bracket keys we can bump the brush size up there a little bit and we can kind of get into more of the bigger wrinkles right there and as you can see we are just removing all the different wrinkles right here on our commander-in-chief and you notice the little moles around his face right there um, you can even kind of just touch those and you can remove those as well and if you didn't see it before honestly trust me it's one of the things that you didn't even necessarily know that was ever there keep in mind ladies that a lot of the images that you see in magazines have been touched to where uh, they remove all kind of different little things like wrinkles and things of that nature however you want to kind of make sure that you're not necessarily bringing forth an unrealistic person so when that person actually gets seen in real life they say oh wow I didn't even recognize you because I didn't even notice the wrinkles there so as I mouse down right here with the um, opacity I can kind of bring the wrinkles back there just a little bit in reference to an opaque level there to still have it to where he's looking younger and you know we removed all the wrinkles there so I can kind of go through here and I can touch this even more if I decided I wanted to however for the sake of this tutorial I want to keep it nice sweet simple and short so go ahead and give it a try let me know how it worked out for you and I will talk to you guys in the next tutorial have a great day. Goodbye now.